Oh, we missed that one though. <laughs> what's going on there, everybody? What y'all doing, man? What's happening? What's busting? What's up, man? How the world treat y'all? We good? Everybody good? I hope everybody good. So, yo, we're going to run them up. Proven Demons, still there. We're going to run it up. You got his own playlist. It's all good. I ain't mad. We just going to keep running them up. We still going to just keep proving stuff. You know what I'm saying? He still got a couple more challenges we got to go through. Uh, and then he, he uh, it's, I mean, and to be honest with you, I, I can't even front y'all to be honest with you. It's actually some of the stuff I ain't even ever heard of. Like, like, uh, like today's episode, we got, uh, we got Real Banshee. Real Banshee's coming on. T- I don't know. I mean, I'm not sure. I, I don't, I'm not sure if this is the, the, the screaming thing, like the thing that's supposed to be screaming. I'm not sure. I think that's I think this is what it is. Now that I'm actually thinking about it, Banshee. Cause I know they yell. I know Banshee. You know what I'm saying? Like the X Man. The X Man do. Uh, was it X Man? Banshee screamed. He had like a voice, like a siren, almost. But it was more like Sindel. Like it more, yeah. I think it more hit like Sindel. I think that's what a Banshee is, something like Sindel. Uh, but yeah, he uh, he said they got it. They said they. Uh, Andrew say he got a real real banshee caught on tape. Uh extremely scary ghost documentary. So we're doing a documentary with this one, y'all. Uh so we got thirty eight minutes. Hope you got thirty minutes in you. You know what I'm saying? We can rock this out. We can check this doc out. Uh see what they talk about. See if we can catch this uh this banshee. Um You know what I'm talking about? I hope you got what you need because I do. We got what we need in the air. You feel me? Um, let's let's get to doing what we're doing, y'all. You know how we do it. Let's get it bussing. I don't really know what it is, so let's let's find out. What the fuck was that? What the scream? A whole bunch of Elfleton bombs dropped. That was proper loud as well. It wasn't me, but y'all bear with them. Just bear with, bear with them. You know they, they you know they. By, by now you should know. They just, they, they let them fly. So. Oh, fuck. Walked in here, and there was fucking a voice. Like, like, I don't be tripping on profanity, but it's you know some of y'all be having sensitive ears. You know what I mean? What the fuck, you guys? I just caught something on camera. I just caught a white light on camera. And yes, I do understand the, the 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 children aspect of it. I'm not I'm not a complete, you know what I'm talking about. I do I do I I am a I am a father myself, you know. But when I got to go hard, I guess no fucks. All right, so tonight <laughs> we are at Lady Mabel's College Campus, an area with six buildings and extreme haunting and paranormal activity. I'm actually looking really forward to doing this. It's me and Olivia here, but we also have a couple other people. Uh, some people that you guys may know, uh, now known as Elemental Encounters, formerly known as Phantoms Paranormal. So let's go don't say know, hi to them. They have them. more experience than we do here, though. Last time we were here, we had some extreme activity. How are you two doing? Hi, guys. Yeah, we're good, Franks. How are you? Oh, some man. gold frames. <laughs> I'm digging them. Digging them gold frames uh, right there. I'm digging them so gold I'm frames. Sit here real quick. I think they go. Um, can you tell us a little bit about your? Maybe, maybe that rose gold. Like, uh, they look, look like they gold seen, though. Gold. Gold. I mean gold lens. Well, originally we come here on an explore. Okay. Um, it was like a week before Halloween. Um, immediately we got a young child shout his name out, Stuart. 
of a spirit box. Okay. We didn't think much on it, but we we decided to come back Halloween night, um, and that's where the whole magic happened for us. This is why we're here today. Yeah. Um, we met uh, two, what well, let's call them my well, I don't know, entities for now. Yeah. Uh, Tommy and Stuart, the well, telling us that there was some sort of groundskeeper, like keeping them in buildings. See, now interestingly, uh, last time we were here, we called Andy up who uh, tipped us off on this location. And while we were on the bottom floor, he tells us about the groundskeeper. <laughs> yeah, I yeah. Seen. Other than his hair being dreaded, he remind me of Ritz. <laughs> interest in this entity mm-hmm. actually the way you described it just creeped me the fuck out mm-hmm. uh tell us a bit about the groundskeeper what what is it or what what does it look like what does it do well uh, i was last one to see him but okay. um basically you get this change in, in atmosphere yeah. when he's coming okay. i meant i meant really to say down, uh really lock, locked up and it will just stand up we, we, we yeah just, it's definitely locked yeah um becky saw him first yeah. and claudia our next team member saw him i was last to see him but he don't take no notice at humans. He was just looking for children. Oh, petty. He was just looking for children. Yeah. Fairly strange. So is this like, is he a possible threat or danger, do you think? Well, Tommy told us not to leave the building until he'd gone. He actually yeah. physically warned us not to leave. And then Tommy actually escorted us off the grounds and run back here while we were clear to run. So it sounds like there is potential for danger. And I'll tell you, mm-hmm. uh, when me and Olivia were here last, actually, on our way out, we had noticed in the grounds outside the building we are at, there was a, a chair that wasn't there before when we had came in. It was as if it got moved or pushed into, like, in front of the door we were at. Mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, just really strange. But we got we got a really bad vibe. But the odd thing is, we started we started seeing, like, ch- like a child. Both mm-hmm. of us are seeing a child with our own eyes out the corner of our eyes, right? Uh, and we t- called Andy afterward. No, we were on the phone with you when this was happening, and we told him. And this was like right then. He was like, "Oh, the the children." You know? so yeah. That's when he brought up the groundskeeper, yeah, saying that the children were trying to warn us not to fucking go outside because the groundskeeper was about. Mm-hmm. So who knows what the fuck will happen? Um. <laughs> Leave it up to them babies. They, them babies gonna let you know. Uh, and essentially, we are going. Especially when they move to haunting. Uh, the majority of the night, it just them. come whatever. Way. Uh, Excuse me. Death wish, bro. I'm all the way. I'm all the way. Eleanor. Right, so there was an Eleanor. Baby, baby, ba- ba- uh, buddy didn't want to let the babies go. Had them in that mansion. You know what I'm saying? He didn't want to let them go. I was like, no. You know what I'm talking about? He wanted them babies, boy. You feel me? Oh, um, yeah, it sounded like what he on. We all we all got our death wishes. We're ready to <laughs> just come up. But them babies will let you know. They'll pop up. You know what I'm talking about? They tell you, listen, man, if a, if a kid spirit, a child spirit pop up on you, man, and tell you that you in danger and, oh, oh, my gosh, here he really comes. You know what I'm talking about? Man, you better tuck tayo and get your, man, you better get ghosts. No pun intended. Um, we're going to start exploring this in a little bit and uh, just see what we can pick up on an initial walkthrough and all that, see where we want to start. But I'm excited to get into this. Mm-hmm. Right. Let's get it. That's what we're here for. That's what we're here for. Let's get it, y'all. You realize one of these days we're going to open a door and there's going to just be a dead guy there, right? <laughs> one day it's going to happen. He's going to speak it into existence. Watch. One day he's going to walk in there and it's going to be there too. Watch. Speaking it because he's speaking it to his listeners. Uh, you better be filming, otherwise, they're gonna be like, Okay, <laughs> did you do this? All right, all right, Logan Paul situation. And everybody, there's a dead man on the toilet. Not today, good. <laughs> if this becomes the Proving Demon's Death Seeker home base, I call this one. Don't listen. It dicks on everything. <laughs> like that's just the go-to. Huh? Come check this 
so. It's kind of airy. Just help. Yep. I just pop this up there. Um, extend the self esteem. Yeah, extend it. Oh, yeah. I was just about to say, you only got a stick? If somebody grabs the camera, I'm going to be like, what the fuck? Nothing's gonna kill you. Hopefully. It smells like piss all of a sudden. Who did it? Just don't look at me. It's not me. Andy, I know your stomach's upset. Hey, no, you didn't. <laughs> not tonight. <laughs> power in the building. Phones are None of us have internet. It doesn't, it doesn't want me to touch it. Are you okay with... Boy, they about to blow that motherfucker up, boy. I've never heard the bear sound like that. Never. Step towards me. I'm gonna walk away. That's picking up on, like, extreme levels of EMF right now. What? Is that you? Move forward to you? No. No. <laughs> it was on the yeah, I'm just going to move away for a bit, not for a bit, past the light. That's why you were picking it up. Something attached it's itself on. to you. Oh. Yep, there it is. Oh, I'm coming to chills now, all of a sudden. Hello there. Um, hello. Oh. I feel like I got that first walk in and it's gone. Feel that? It, yeah. it feels like an eerie quiet all of a sudden. <coughs> <coughs> Are you out in the hallway now? This reminds me of me over here because we were. We, we got him in a room and then as soon as we went in there, any equipment and all the left. So run out and then run back in. It's like they were running around us all the time. You said last time you were here, you could throw an airsoft bead down the hall mm -hmm. and if you're very lucky, they might throw one back. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Let's move into the hall just for a second and just kind of test it. Let me try this again. I want to throw this into the bathroom. The same way I did a minute ago, and just see if we get the same tab. My friend, can you replicate the sound for me? Let me see right here. Feels a lot more. I don't know how to explain it. There's no words. Energized. 
energized. You feel it now. It felt dead when we first came in here, but again with investigating, it's just about finding it. If you can replicate the noise, I'm gonna miss. I know I'm gonna miss. Right? You can't miss that. It's a right oil. Throw that back up here for me, please. That's what I heard. What the fuck was that? What the scream? That fuck. was a scream. That was a dull scream. Like a young That was proper loud as well. Alright, so now we are in one of the main rooms where we first heard about the groundskeeper. Uh, Andy, real quick. Who did you say saw it in this area? Um, Becky saw it at middle window. Claudia saw him and uh, I saw him in this window down to next to right here. And then there was a plot that at different points at night were really random. It's like he was circling building, that's what it felt like. Okay. And you said that it felt like he couldn't see us. Yeah, he weren't looking for us. It, we were seeing when he were looking for little ones. And in this room is where me and Olivia experienced uh, seeing like a child or like a little spirit out the corner of her eyes. Uh, we both were noticing it without even telling each other it. And then she told me, and I just thought, like, what the hell, I've been seeing the same shit. So we're gonna do a quick spirit box and just see if we can maybe reach out to this little spirit. Maybe they can tell us a bit about who the groundskeeper could be. Hello. Any spirits around that would like to communicate with us? You speak through the spirit box in my hand. If there's anyone here, could you start by just saying, I'm here for me? It wasn't Sam there. Um, cool. Great. Uh, I'm really fascinated and curious about this supposed groundskeeper here. Do you know who I'm talking about? The spirit that comes and looks at us through the windows? If you know who I'm speaking of, could you just say the word groundskeeper for me? Is the captain around? Could you tell, if you know who we're talking about, the captain, or who we've been calling the groundskeeper, could you say the name captain for me? through clearly. Tell me what you're trying to say. Did you say I'm captain? I'll kill you. I heard that too. I'll kill you and I'm captain. Do you want to come up to me and talk to me? Do you want to grab me? This window's completely busted out. Try and grab me then. 
Then it said hi. I guess that's the baby's. Baby's telling you to hide, cause no. Do we need to be hiding? Could you say the word hide if we have to hide from the captain or anyone? Hide. Where are you going to hide? Something happened. Scream or run out. What the fuck? No way. Yes, no way. fucking way. Yes, no way. No way. The door. I saw it go in. The door just shut itself. Did you catch it? Okay. No. They're oh, they keep coming. Okay, it's fine. We were all you'll, you'll hear it though. The hell can us hide? Okay, right, okay. Get, get back behind okay. the wall. I'm getting my spirit box out. Becky, fill the door for me. Yep. My son and his father. It's like they're hiding in here with us. They shut the door behind us. Can we go downstairs? Say downstairs if we can go downstairs. Uh, she What's the matter? Like a, it was yellow light. It was probably a headlight. No, it was a white light. Well, to be fair, we are shining a light in this room, which is looking over the fucking college. Not exactly the smartest place to be doing it. By the way, open the door if you can come out now. Please. It doesn't seem to be coming down, does it? No. It seemed to be up there by the top. It's dark in here. Yeah, it's got a lot darker. I don't know why, but it's well working for me. It's like it will repel it in me. I'll keep an eye on somebody and leave it in. I don't know why I did until I tried turning it off. It's loud enough. Yeah. Try again. I see we go. I see we go downstairs. Are we able to go downstairs now? You are. You are.
It is 12. 12 in the building. that serious even if one did come up to just tell us to go but yeah we'll be back I didn't know where we are I can see them going okay we just strolled out car's just gone out I think this is the first time we got a cop y'all oh god fucking just took an hour <laughs> <coughs> sweet we're clearing it but hey Thanks to this, we have been inspired to film in pitch black and not use torches for the remainder of the night. Mm -hmm. Not counting the fact that I may have ran out of memory on my phone as well. <laughs> I'm very surprised. Oh, God. Yeah, now we're clear. What the fuck? A door opening? Yeah. Alright, let's check it out, come on. Uh, somebody wants to shine a blue light on the floor so we can actually see. A door just opened on... Wait, shh. What door was that? You guys, I can't see shit. That way. There's nothing that way, so it's not that way. Where the fuck did that go? Alright you guys, just heads up, night vision is blind to me, so you guys are going to have to leave or something. I can't see shit. Where did that come from? It sounded like a cupboard door. But the cupboard doors are ripped off on that one. It was close by. There's no way that it was this far down. Becky, turn your torch off. Let's uh, just listen for a minute and call out. I wish you guys could know. Whoever's watching this right now, I wish you could just see the fucking darkness. I'm just trying to. I'm just trying to listen. That wacky crow. Yeah, you're still there. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to listen. Can you come out of the room? Can you make a noise to let us know you're here? Probably could have been faint on the other end, right? That's not it. Let's stand at the top of the stairs. Somebody down there? If there's someone down there, could you make a noise to let us know? The door is coming from out there. A door again. It's up here for sure. Sure, That was a person. I heard that. For sure. That was a person. 
It was like a full sentence, wasn't it? Hello? We walked into the stairwell. We just walked into the stairwell. Asked for someone to make a noise. We heard the door, a door, open again from this level. Walked in here. And there was fucking a voice. There like, was a woman. There was a... It's down there. I'm, saying, hey, I'm sitting here turning my head. Like I got head too, you know what I'm saying? Camera. But it's, it's, it's left and right in my headphones. Camera. So it's like when I hear it, I, here. I'm, I'm going to the side of the head. And a like, voice. Oh. There's a woman. There's a It's down there. What the fuck? You guys, I just caught something on camera. I just caught a white light on camera. I just caught that on camera. Right, bit. Okay. So, who's first? Huh? <laughs> Do you want us to come down there? It looks like there's a person walking towards us. I keep hearing that one on the voice, man. Yeah, I see, I see what you mean, too. Creak the door if you want us down there. Oh my god. Okay. We'll come to you. Okay. okay. That, this is what you wanted. Here we come. I shit you not. This is actually happening right now, guys. Which one, Mario? Uh, That's what we're here for. I think it was on the right. It was either this door or that door. I was back, girl. I thought it was 2019. Yeah. Why number 19? I could have sworn it was down here. I saw the white orb at the end of the tunnel, or the corridor. Someone in here. Is that you, Beck? What? You made those studs? No. Oh. That was behind us. I didn't move. Can you whistle back? Try and copy my tune. Hey, hey, is that some? Is that some right there, y'all? With that? Is that some right there? What that is right there? That was a woman crying. That was a woman crying. That was a woman crying. We've heard a woman screaming tonight, a woman talking, and now a woman just cried back. Higher than that. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe it was a woman from yep. the last year. Oh, just went past you. I seen it in my eyes. Okay. There's a motherfucking crying. Ma'am, are you okay? <laughs> no, I <he> said no. I <laughs> 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 I swear to God, I just said nice ass. Yeah. It's an Andy, nice ass. <laughs> Honestly. That's what you heard? Yeah. Fuck yeah. <laughs> He's thick, boy. He's thick AF. Alright, um. <laughs> 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 uh, I worry about you sometimes. <laughs> Why? <laughs> nice ass. Honestly. I swear to God, I just said nice ass. Yeah. He said Andy, nice ass. Honestly. <laughs> That's what you heard? Own him. Look at him. Can take a shot. He's thick, boy. He's thick AF. Alright, um. <laughs> 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 I worry about you sometimes. <laughs> 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 I swear to God, I just said nice ass. Yeah. He said Andy, nice ass. Honest
worry about you sometimes. <laughs> yeah, I was say, yeah, like, I'm wrong with you. I'm wrong with you. Uh, I didn't make too many jokes, sorry. It's just my nature. Um, I'm not wrong with that. Cassie Light, we're gonna try the pellet. Just staying out of the camera. If I throw one down the hall, can you throw one back towards us? Please? All I'll do is let us know that you're, you're there and you're able to talk and communicate. Are you seeing anything on the camera? No. It's too dark. That opened and then closed. That opened and closed. Okay, no. What the fuck? Let's try this game one more time. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's all good. Catch, my friend. Why fucking stupid? Why am I throwing fucking pellets at a fucking ghost? Whoa. 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 Just keep filming. I mean no disrespect by doing this. I swear to God, I mean no disrespect. Just keep filming down the fucking hole. This way in. Are you still filming? I am now. Okay. You notice we walk out and it stops? Yep. Okay, my friend, I mean, no disrespect by this. Uh, those watching, the girls are li they're literally pissing themselves because of how intense this has been. I mean, no disrespect. Whoa. What? What you just kept? An arm's just falling out your head. I mean, no disrespect. Whoa. What? What you just kept? An arm's just falling out your head. My friend, I mean, no disrespect. Could you. I could have sworn I just saw a shadow man behind you, like, standing in the hall. Uh, Becky's gonna come out in a sec, so... Can you throw these back? The door didn't open. That's Becky coming out. What the absolute fuck was all that? <laughs> I hope we didn't scare it away because we all were like, oh my god. <laughs> my friend, thank you. We are so sorry, but you made us nervous, we. Oh, it's so weird, though. It's like, as soon as you guys had to go piss yourselves, activity just fucking dropped. Alright, so, uh, we've been here for several hours now. It's they literally had to go and pee, y'all. Uh, damn. <laughs> of phenomenon. <laughs> they were scared for real. A police officer come by and try and find us, but we got away this time. Uh, overall, I'm quite impressed with this location. Um, I do look forward to coming back again. Scared the piss out of him. Because it's just fucking crazy here. It, it's just one of those nights I'm stunned. I am honestly stunned. I mean, how, how did you feel about the night? Sorry, what? It was all right. It was all right. Yeah, it really was. <laughs> and you too. Absolutely amazing. I loved it. We had a, a bit of everything tonight. Things showing up on camera, doors banging, creaking, bloody amount of screams, laughs, voices. Crying. I'm just crying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 You can't yeah. see your faces. <laughs> Shine up a bit. There we go. It was absolutely amazing, honestly. I know, I know, we're laughing, but it's been a very interesting night. Um, and Becky, your thoughts? It's been good. It's been mm -hmm. self-activity. Yeah, yeah, really. <laughs> it's one of the best. Yeah. So that that's gonna conclude. That's gonna wrap it up. You know what I'm talking about? I I can't be mad at that. You know what I'm saying? Them doors was going Hamilton. They had screams. Like they called it out, you know what I'm talking about? They had a whole bunch of good good stuff, you know what I'm saying, that we had. Uh, so, you know what I'm saying, 
that's why we still rocking with with proven demons because bro is really pulling out some uh some nice compelling evidence um you know what I'm saying? Of course, we're gonna we're gonna eventually move on, but we're gonna we're gonna knock out all the challenges before we do that. Uh, so, I hope y'all enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if y'all rocking with it. You know what I'm saying? Until next time, I appreciate y'all hanging out with me. <laughs>